Hello everyone, I will show you how to use the stock count feature on Big Seller in this video. Stock counting is the physical verification of the quantities and the condition of items held in your warehouse. This may be done to provide an adult of existing stock. Before you use this feature on Big Seller, please note that the merchant SKUs in counting will be locked. You are not able to delete merchant SKUs, change the mapping relationships, stock in or stock out. Also, you cannot pack or ship these orders, including these merchant SKUs. Next, I will show you how to use this feature on Big Seller. Go to Big Seller Inventory Stock Account. Firstly, you need to click here to add a new count task. Here you can select a warehouse you want to count and select a count tab. There are three count tabs. If you select a count by merchant SKU, you can select the merchant SKUs you want to count here. If there are too many merchant SKUs, you can also click here to import the merchant SKUs to big seller. If you select a count by shelf, you can select shelves here. You can also import shelves to Big Seller. And if you select by warehouse, it will select all merchant SKUs in this warehouse. For example, here I select by merchant SKU and select some merchant SKUs I want to count. Click Confirm and click Generate Task. Here you can see this count task has been generated successfully. Then you can click this button to start counting. Then this count task has been moved to counting list. Here you can select this count task and print the count list. Then you can take this count list and go to your warehouse to count the stock. After counting your warehouse, you can click here to start counting and enter the counting number. For example, after you enter the count number, Big Seller will show the count results here. For example, inventory loss, normal or inventory gain. After you finish the counting, Big Seller will update the new count number to Big Seller. If there are too many merchant SKUs, and uh, you can click save and continue the count task next time. You can check the count progress here. You can click here to continue the counting. After doing this, you can click here to finish counting. Then the count task will be moved to completed list and the counting stock will be updated. Also, you can, in counting, you can also import the counting to, to Big Seller and Big Seller will update the counting results. Okay guys, it is all about the stock count feature on Big Seller. Please contact us if you have any other questions.